Hey everyone, it's Kristen and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. So for today's video, you guys, this is week two of Adopt Me's Halloween update, which is trick or treat. So you guys probably remember in the video I posted already today, we made all three of the new pets into neons. We also have a new mini game, but in today's video, we're gonna be checking out the new haunted house and furniture pack. So before we get started, of course, as always, make sure that you guys have notifications on, that you guys are subscribed, and let's go ahead and just get started. Don't forget to use star code Kristen when buying Robux or premium. It helps support me and my channel. Okay, guys, if you wanna check out making all three of the new pets into neons like this ghost dog, that video is on my channel, so of course, check that one out once you have watched this one because this is going to be a lot of fun. This is my favorite type of updates, you guys. The new homes and the new furniture, it's what I live for. I just need more bucks. I need to get farming some bucks. Okay, so let's go over to my homes and let's check out the new Halloween home. So we need to see if we can find it. We've got this scary haunted house right here. There it is. So we have 1,950 for the haunted home. Okay, I wanna change the color. I wish this was over out of the way. So let's do pink. Actually, let's do more of like a mauve color. Oh yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, we're gonna need some bucks. Let's just go ahead, grab this one. So we have a little bit to work with because we also do need to get our furniture as well. Okay, so yes. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. We haven't really seen anything inside of this. <gasps> oh, this is so cute. Okay, I'm talking Adam's family here. Okay, so let's head inside and see what this looks like. I'm, <gasps> I hope this isn't like too ginormous because I really wanna decorate it and I'm broke. <laughs> I don't have much money. Okay, let's see, I love the windows. Oh my gosh, wait movable <gasps> it's movable okay I love that all right so making sure okay this needs to go up one more there we go okay let's stop editing so I don't want to mess anything up okay so the first room is oh a cute little sitting room like a living room area this oh we have a hallway and we have another living room and then in the back, oh, okay, this is a good size now that I'm seeing this. Oh, you guys know I love my floating candles. I've done a tutorial for that. Okay, so we have our dining room, and then the back is like a kitchen area. The rooms are not too big, so these are not gonna be too intimidating to build with. I love that. I think Adopt Me did good on this one. Okay, so we have the TV, and then what is this room? Because there is no joining door. Have a trap door okay wait let's take a quick little overview so when you first walk in there's this room the hallway like this little tv room the hallway the bigger tv room and then over there is like the kitchen area and dining room and then over here oh my gosh it looks like we have a trap door upstairs i wonder if we're going to be able to get here from the stairs as well okay Oh my gosh, you guys know I've done this tutorial with the floating books. I love this. It reminds me of Harry Potter. Okay, I dropped me. I love this. I love the bookshelves. This is epic. Okay, I cannot wait to see the furniture they gave us. Okay, I love the trap door. Oh, okay. So you can get there through here and then there's this door. Perfect. These rooms are perfectly sized. And then in the back is another room. Oh no. A room that goes to a room. And then, oh, I cannot wait to see this furniture. I'm seeing a lot of new stuff. <laughs> and then, okay, over here is like a little seance area. And then the back room. Where does this go? Ooh, okay, so we have like a little closet in this room also. And then we have the rooms to the right, which is this one, nice. And then we have this one. I already have an idea of exactly what I plan to do with this build. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. All right, so next up, let's go over and 
we're gonna check out the new furniture. Okay, so let's go stuff. So we have the new section, haunted house right here. So let's go back. Yeah, we got haunted house. Oh, that's a lot of new stuff. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot. So we have the spider web shelf. You're not really gonna be able to see this, but let's change it to white. And then you guys can see the shelf a little bit better. We also have the spider web corner plates, which you can't really see, but if we turn this white, you can see this a little bit better. And you can resize this one also. And the spider web chair. Again, let's make this white so you can see it. And the bat wing shelf. Oh my gosh, wait, this is gonna be cute. Bigger. And let's make this pink. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait. Oh my gosh, I have so many ideas. Okay, this build will be up tomorrow because <laughs> I'm excited. I had the best idea that I hope you guys like. Okay, we also have the candle candelabra. Cadabra. Oh my gosh, you guys, tell me how to say that word in the comments <laughs> because I have no idea. Okay, we also have the spider web water and food or the spider food and water. Let's make this one pink so we do have food and water. Okay. And then we also have the haunted house fridge. This one is new and I feel like this is gonna be so cool to use in builds. Like you can make this huge and build like your own little tower. So what changes color? Oh, perfect. Oh, more ideas. And then we also have the bat wing crib change the color love that and then we also have the museum shower probably said that wrong I'm not good at pronunciation cute and then this is my favorite you guys we have the crystal ball oh it's a pet bed oh I thought it came with the ghost dog in it okay so what changes color let's do blue Okay, so the bed inside actually changes color so you can make this any color that you want. And then you can put your dog in there. Okay, that's actually amazing. <laughs> I think that is probably one of my favorite things. And then lastly, we have the Hearst Parent Bed. A little bit morbid, but here's Halloween. Let's change this to pink. Oh, we can actually sit and sleep. Oh, creepy. <laughs> oh, that is so creepy. Okay, you guys. So, there is the new haunted house and the new furniture. I absolutely am going to be doing a build with this. So, look for that this weekend. Also, if you guys have any ideas on how you want me to decorate this, let me know in the comments. Maybe I'll do more than one. Make sure to give today's video a big thumbs up and check out the video I posted earlier where we made all three new pets into neons. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.